All right, grouper season 2022 is upon us. Uh, this video is going to be of a couple different dives that I've done. So I uh, got out June 1st for opening season, took off work, and it was Levi, Nikki, and myself, and uh, this spot was just loaded with fish as soon as we got there. So I didn't even make it to the main rock yet, and I had already bagged one of the fish. Uh, Levi on his first drop had also shot one so uh, overall this was just a super fishy day and we were right in the action right away so I uh, got a pretty nice grouper I believe he was around 26 inches and so uh, always happy to get one in the boat right away my next plan was to find one that was a little bit bigger and so I was looking around uh, for a while hoping to find one and uh, I ended up flubbing a shot on one of them and so uh, that's this clip here I'm not super proud uh, when I end up tearing out a fish but honestly it, it happens it's a part of spearfishing and I'd be lying to you guys if I didn't show you clips like this so hit him he ran he actually ended up in a rock the spear was just barely in the top of him and uh, it was just such a tight little spot that I ended up just pulling the, the shaft out, trying to get him out, and I just couldn't get him again. So, a uh, new spot, and and now I've decided that uh, I don't necessarily need a bigger grouper, just any grouper. And so, I'm just kind of hanging out. The spade fish were all around, uh, nibbling at the spur gun and all that kind of stuff. Um, I don't really mess with spade fish. I find the meat quality to be pretty poor. But, you know... They're always around. Ended up with a really nice shot on this grouper. So it was just one of those really nice layups. He was just slowly cruising through, really calm, and just stone him. And so uh, that caps day one uh, spearfishing. And then it's off to the next day. And so uh, using a different gun on this day, um, and uh, just this is also a different spot entirely, cruising around, looking for my group of friends. The second day was not nearly as fishy as the first day. Uh, I think a lot of people had just been getting grouper. And so um, there was lots of small grouper, uh, but not a lot of decent sized ones. So again, this is probably a 26 inch fish. Not my best shot ever, uh, but end up securing him. And uh, I'll have a clip here in a second. Every fish that I get, I always have the same routine, uh, which is that I brain them, uh, gill them, and gut them. So put them out of their misery real quick, and then you just stick your knife uh, through the gills. And what I like to get is that little spot on the corner up there, like you can see. If you can get that spot, they bleed out. Um, and then I just take the, the guts out to make sure that the you know nothing's been contaminated, it's nice and fresh. And the fillets that I get off these fish, I mean, it's just so beautiful. It's, it's a really nice, snowy white, uh, tastes great, never has any fishy flavor. If you leave the blood in them, uh, when they sit in the cooler, the blood can, can pool on one side of the fillet, and you'll get a bloody fillet. So it just doesn't, it's it's visually not as appealing, and I think taste-wise probably affects it a little bit. And uh, and so this is just kind of a good routine that I found for consistent quality fillets. All right, back on the hunt. And so uh, again, these grouper were all kind of just out in the sand. And so I nailed that one. Uh, he was trying to get away. And luckily the shaft went through, came out his jaw. Uh, really nice, secure shot again. Probably like another 26 inch fish, roughly. So nothing huge uh, to start off season this year, but I got four fish, a lot to be happy about. Already done a few cookouts, family and friends. So um, overall, great start to the season. Hoping for more clear weather and uh, more video clips here. This is the bag from day one. I didn't get a clip from day two. Look at that huge hogfish. I didn't shoot that, but Nikki did. What a stud. Anyway, if you enjoyed, uh, like, subscribe, and uh, stick around. Thanks, guys.